Major projects and government facilitated projects are an important part of the Northern Territory economy. They create new jobs and unlock opportunities for Territorians. There are nine facilitated projects valued at over $30 billion and 14 projects with major project status valued at over $20 billion in the NT. I'm with Anne Tan from the Department of Trade, Business and Innovation. So Anne, what's the difference between a major project and a government facilitated project? So a major project and a government facilitated project are basically very similar in that they both are aimed at leveraging private sector opportunities. Where they are different in terms of a major project, that's where the private sector comes to government with an initiative that it is interested to progress. Examples are Project Sea Dragon, which is a prawn farm development, and Arafura Resources, which is a rare earths mine. The government facilitated investment projects, on the other hand, is where government has an idea that it would be interested in the private sector progressing. And so we approach the private sector with a project and we seek private interest in that project. Examples of that are the Darwin Luxury Hotel Development and the Darwin Shiplift. We've got 14 major projects that have government imprimatur. The first one I've discussed earlier was Project Sea Dragon. That is a $1.45 billion prawn aquaculture development. It will see the development of over 10,000 hectares of land across three different sites in the Northern Territory. It will be the largest project of its kind in Australia and one of the largest in the world. It is important from a government perspective that there are a series of projects in development and that's where the concept of a pipeline has come through. What it does is it puts the private sector on notice of what the government's expectations around new projects is going to be and it gives the private sector an opportunity to be prepared to submit responses as the government goes out with expressions of interest. For more information about major projects, visit business.nt.gov.au.